So how do we manage procedural pain? How do we make sure that children who get vaccinated, where we draw blood, who get stitches, have excellent pain control? Three things are non-negotiable. Number one, um, positioning. We have to make sure that a child can be held upright by um, a parent. Number two, we must use some sort of distraction. Depending on the age, this may be bubble blowing, this may be um, playing on a um, computer, this may be reading a story, this may be telling us um, um, just um, a story like imagine something. And number three is to numb the skin. We absolutely must, as there's no other way to do it, numb the skin before we vaccinate a child or before we uh, draw some um, blood. And this could be um, a patch which we, going, which we are going to put on um, 30 or 60 minutes um, early, such as an Emla patch or an Almex patch or there are many others. Uh, or we do something very quick like the J-tip where we uh, just numb the skin within a few seconds. So, Number one, positioning. Number two, distraction. And number three, using um, numbing skin medications are absolutely essential. If your child is younger than 12 months, so an infant, zero to 12 months, then we always must use some sucrose, um, some sugar water um, under the mouth during the painful procedure.